with this video today i hope to really encourage you guys to get involved with other people whether it's through an organization or everyday experiences as francis chan says there is another path an alternative to the individualism selfishness and materialism of the american dream hey guys it's your girl Mario from soul Salt baby and today i'm going to be doing a video called i don't matter i have a lot of great things to say so i hope that you guys stay tuned and let me know what you think about this video i really like when you guys comment and engage in a conversation with me rather than liking this video but you guys can still like it but my ratings do not show because i want you guys to actually engage i don't get any type of excitement from lights um it's nice but i would rather you guys engage in a conversation with me but anyways let me know if you like this video and let me know if you have any type of opinions leave them down below bye okay so i've been telling you guys that i've been on a spiritual journey with just developing a relationship with god and it is one of the best journeys i've ever took in my entire life um the relationship with god that i am currently having and building is so great i've been changing and i've been seeing fabulous and wonderful changes in my life so um yeah so one of the things that god has really been pushing me to do is being selfless and telling myself like honestly you don't matter being that we're in a world that really wants you to always validate yourself through status um social media likes how pretty you are and so on it is so hard to just not think about you and to just be humble and just just live without being so focused on just you while i was going to see my grandmother yesterday on the bus i was really reading through first corinthians so two things that i um, pulled out from first corinthians when i was going to visit my grandmother i was really trying to dissect um this part of the bible and i just pulled out two things one being so whether you eat or drink or whatever you do do it all for the glory of god the second being no one should seek their own good but the good of others and i think this truly exemplifies what being a christian is is being kind hearted towards one another and really trying to focus on something other than yourself one being god and two being his people we were so focused on where we want to be that we feel like we can't uplift another person and pour love into someone else and help them i was watching a powerful video and i'm gonna link that video down below if i can find it um and it was about this guy and they did a social experiment in New York City and it was a little boy, a little boy, he probably looked like he was 15 and it was when New York City was like 5 degrees and he literally had just a t-shirt and a plastic bag and everybody passed him like it was the saddest thing I've ever saw and it's like so easy to do that and I'm really trying to work in a way where I can help other people and volunteer through different organizations to help other people besides myself. What is life if you're living only for yourself? I really just want you guys to have these three takeaways, which is do not become a slave of this world, just become a slave of God. Become something bigger than yourself and get into different organizations and get into talking to people and really finding out if they need help hurting people and see 